God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Your sorrow will be turned into joy. Alleluia. When the Lord delivered Zion from bondage, it seemed like a dream. Then was our mouth filled with laughter. On our lips there were songs. The heathens themselves said, What marvels the Lord worked for them. What marvels the Lord worked for us. Indeed, we were glad. Deliver us, O Lord, from our bondage, as streams in dry land. Those who are sowing in tears will sing when they reap. They go out, they go out, full of tears, carrying seed for the sowing. They come back, they come back, full of song, carrying their sheaves. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Your sorrow will, will be, be turned, turned into, into joy. joy. Alleluia. Whether we live or die, we are the Lord's. Alleluia. If the Lord does not build the house, in vain do its builders labor. If the Lord does not watch over the city, in vain does the watchman keep vigil. In vain is your earlier rising, your going later to rest, you who toil for the bread you eat, when he pours gifts on his beloved while they slumber. Truly, sons are a gift from the Lord, a blessing, the fruit of the womb. Indeed, the sons of youth are like arrows in the hand of a warrior. Oh, the happiness of the man who has filled his quiver with these arrows. He will have no cause for shame when he disputes with his foes in the gateways. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Whether we live or die, we, we are, are the Lord's. Lord's. Alleluia. From him, through him, and in him, all things exist. Glory to him forever. Alleluia. Let us give thanks to the Father for having made you worthy to share the lot of the saints in light. He rescued us from the power of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of his beloved Son. Through him we have redemption, the forgiveness of our sins. He is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creatures. In him, everything in heaven and on earth was created, things visible and invisible. All were created through him, all were created for him. He is before all else that is. In him, everything continues in being. It is he who is head of the body, the church, he who is the beginning, the firstborn of the dead, so that primacy may be his in everything. It pleased God to make absolute fullness reside in him, and, by means of him, to reconcile everything in his person, both on earth and in the heavens, making peace through the blood of his cross. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. From him, through him, and in him, all things exist. Glory to him forever. Alleluia. These are the ones who have survived the great period of trial. They have washed their robes and made them white in the blood of the Lamb. It was this that brought them before God's throne. Day and night they minister to him in the temple. He who sits on the throne will give them shelter. Never again shall they know hunger or thirst, nor shall the sun or its heat 
beat down on them, for the Lamb on the throne will shepherd them. He will lead them to springs of life-giving water, and God will wipe every tear from their eyes. The splendor of the just will shine before God. Alleluia, alleluia. The splendor of the just will shine before God. Alleluia, alleluia. The upright of heart will rejoice. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. The splendor of the just will shine before God. Alleluia, alleluia. This is the hour when the King of Martyrs offered his life in the upper room and laid it down on the cross. Let us thank him and say, We praise you, O Lord. We praise you, O Lord our Savior, inspiration and example for every martyr, for loving us to the end. We praise you, O Lord. For calling all repentant sinners to the rewards of life. We praise you, O Lord for entrusting to your church the blood of the new and everlasting covenant poured out for the remission of sin. We praise you, O Lord. For our perseverance in your grace today. We praise you, O Lord. 
for incorporating our dead brothers and sisters into your own death today. We praise you, O Lord. Our Father, who, who art, art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Father, through the folly of the cross, you taught St. Justin the sublime wisdom of Jesus Christ. May we too reject falsehood and remain loyal to the faith. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.